Alright lads, today we're going to be doing day 35 Ford, which starts in two in-game hours. Uh, I'll show you what I added to the base. Um, I added three rows of spikes all around, but they're only upgraded once. They're still not the metal or anything. And uh, yeah, I have to quickly show you what I added and changed because the horde is coming soon. Um, I think I already started. I don't even know what I was doing down here. I was just turning this into wood, but I was going to keep this like this because I want to put a mine down there. But we'll see how that goes. Uh, as you can see, I have this other sticking out thing here. This is where the farm is going to be. The farm is going to be up on here. Uh, I started turning this to cement. It takes a whole lot of cement. Um, I've been constantly getting attacked by screamers and feral zombies, actually. Feral zombies are coming after me, even though I have them turned off in the main menu. If like the aggression is on normal, it's not on feral. But anyway, I accidentally upgraded this to steel, and I'm not going to upgrade the rest of these to steel, I don't think, because one, that takes way too much steel, and two, I think cement is good enough, and also I think the cement might look a little bit better than that, but we'll see how that goes. I changed all the floors to the uh, adobe peach color, whatever the fuck, let me make sure my, okay, I've been playing on 100% gamma, and up here, I changed up here to a little bit more, make it a little bit more roomy. This is my bed, and this is my little... A little nightstand with a little potted plant on it. This is my desk with nothing in it. We have a nice little chair here. I've been thinking about adding something on top. And then uh, here's a wall safe that I just put here to put like things in for uh, okay skill and oh yeah some like making a blunderbuss. But I just have this here so whenever there's a horde night I can just plop whatever I have in here. This is like the stuff that I usually carry around with me. Uh, I was gonna put a desk safe here, but like you couldn't actually put the desk safe in the desk. I thought you could, but no, apparently not. I added some campfires here, just so we have campfires. Both of them have one cooking pot, one cooking grill, and one beaker. And since my two forges are up here, and my cement mixer, and all the other stuff that ups your heat map, um, I've been getting constantly attacked by screamers and other things that you do not want coming towards you. Alright, uh, I need to cook some more, like, bacon and eggs. I only have three eggs, though. Oh, also, I died once, because a feral zombie came after me, and, like, I wasn't expecting it and it killed me. I don't know why they're coming after me because, oh shit, I didn't want to drop that. Because I don't have feral aggression on. The first one came like, I don't know, day 30 something. Alright, it's becoming night time. I don't think these like change your heat map at all, so I'll take these and put them in here. Oh, yeah, I need to grab wood. Alright, here it is. Oh shit, I didn't even grab it. Alright. i just put that there. Alright, let's make one bacon and eggs. And then, what's the next best thing? Probably grilled meat. Uh, no. Boiled meat won't, like, affect your thirst. Grilled meat. I think grilled meat would be the next best thing. Alright, put this egg in here. Probably put this in here. Alright, I also made a blunderbuss, and I have 100 blunderbuss ammo. Pop, pop. Alright. Oh, boys. She's starting a couple of seconds. See if I have any skill points. I have 11 skill points. Okay. I don't know what to put them in yet. Okay. It's starting. Oh, baby. I'm, I'm going to make a shit ton of cement and forged steel. Or forged iron, not steel. And I... Ooh, that lagged out. And I'm going to put, like, a nice little chest right here for it because I'm going to have, like, a repair chest. The stuff that I use to repair these whatever I have down here. Alright. The wooden spikes. Jesus Christ. Die. Alright, it's dead. Oh, nice, and I leveled up. So I don't know if the blunderbuss actually, like, does damage to things, so I'm scared to use it. Because I don't know if it's going to break things. What if I just... BAH! Okay, I think that hurts my spikes, because I just saw, like, little wood chunks fly out of it. BAH! I don't know if it damages the, uh, iron bars, so... Yeah, okay, and they always seem to come from this side, so... BAH! I don't like they not die. Like, come on now. You're literally right in front of me, and I'm shooting you in the head with a blunderbuss. You should die. Bah. Let me check the other side. Okay, like, nothing ever comes from that side or this side. It's either this side or the front side. Okay, at least this is leveling up my police. Oh, no. Oh, no. There's a cop, and he's destroying the spikes. He, he like, already did a lot of damage to the spikes. Oh god, I hate the cops, because they just destroy shit quickly. Okay, my frame rate is all over the place right now, I'm not sure why. This thing takes a long ass time to reload, oh my. 
All right, we're gonna have to take this guy out. Eventually, I'm gonna add some more spikes. I'm gonna add some barbed wire probably because barbed wire is also pretty good. At least I'd assume it is. I might put some points into shotguns because I can, like blunderbusses, you can just make them and make ammo for them. Unlike other shotguns where you have to find parts for them. So like, I could easily just make blunderbusses whenever I need them. We got a guy right there, his leg just broke. Oh no, there's another cop. Holy shit. Get this little thing out of here. Cheerleader zombie. Whatever the hell. Alright, I'm gonna go fight them like men. And then probably die. So the thing with screamers and like the feral zombies that attacked me, I've never actually seen them outside. Like, I've never seen them during a horde. They only came during like just daytime and I'm just hanging out. Hey, they're destroying my pillars. Bop. Holy shit. Okay. Okay, I gotta... Bop. Oh my. Bop. There's something up with using, like, this friggin' blunderbuss. Like, it's just so much easier for me to use this. Like, like this just takes so much easier. Oh my. Oh my. I'm a little rusty. I haven't played in a couple of days. Holy shit. Oh my god, he charged! He's gonna blow! Okay, they do explode. They do indeed explode. I wasn't actually sure if they exploded. I've heard people say they exploded. Like... See, when I first heard them say that they exploded, I always thought, like, after you killed them, they would explode after you kill them. Not they would run at you and then blow up. So at least now we know. But now my friggin' wellness and shit keeps on going down. God damn it. Ouch, fuck. I'm bleeding now. Are you shitting me? There is an achievement for, uh... Um... Getting or reaching level 100. Oh fuck. Reaching level 180 and more in wellness. And I have no idea how you're supposed to get that because I literally die so much in this game. Look, and I spawn back and the freaking cops are gone. Look, they even destroyed like just the wood that's under it. Jesus Christ. Look, it's so much easier for me to just come out here <coughs> and just attack them like this than it is to sit inside. Because when I sit inside, they literally just break everything. J just look at how shitty this blunderbuss is. Alright, friggin' point blank, in the head. And he doesn't even die. Like, you gotta be shitting me. He's still not dead. Oh my, he's still not dead. This thing sucks asshole. I don't even know why I made another one. I made another one thinking that it might have been like better this time. There's only one time where it actually killed something with one shot and it was a friggin zombie that was at a hospital where I or not a hospital at a school because I was at a school in the game. Like the zombies were spawning in the school. And we got some burn victims. Look at this. I can one shot them with a friggin melee but I can't one shot them with a friggin blunderbuss. Point blank. Like there's something up with that. Shit, I completely missed. Oh my god, I missed again. I can one shot him with this sometimes. Sometimes. Okay. Of course, when I try to like show a point or make a point, it like doesn't one shot him. See, look. Surely he didn't get one shot either. This thing, I'm trying to say, one shot some more often than the blunderbuss. I'm scared to come out here because of feral zombies. Even though I don't have them on, but they still, like, show up for some reason. And I'm infected. I'm not even, even going to use <coughs> any antibiotics yet because... Oh my... Ah! 
Jesus Christ. I'm not even going to use any antibiotics yet because if I just get hit again, and then I'll get infected again. That little fucking pig. Run away. Okay, so it says I have 57 out of 69 schematics. Does that include, like, double reads or, like, rereads of the, oh, shit, of the same book? Because I've reread several of the same books, but if that means 57 different books, that's pretty good because there's only, like, 69, and I almost have all of them, which is pretty rad. I gotta be careful of this guy because he'll fucking charge at me and blow up. Oh, my God. Okay, he started running. Bop. 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 Holy shit. Bop! Still not dead. Oh fuck. I'm just afraid that a feral zombie is gonna come because they're spooky. They're spooky and they look complete, completely different compared to every other zombie in the game. I hate these dogs, man. Alright, I'm bleeding out, but like, I'm sure it's fine. Okay, it is definitely not fine anymore. Back. What if, like, instead of actually fighting them off, I just stood out here and hoarded them up? So that, like, they don't just keep spawning, and then at the end of the horde, I then kill them. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, hoard them up so they don't just keep spawning. Actually, they'd probably still keep spawning, but, like, at least then they won't destroy my shit. Okay, you know, I think I'll just use two of these, because I have a shit ton at my house. And I think, like, yeah, after you use them, you're, like, immune for a while until it wears off. Like, you're not able to get infected. Okay. Bam. Leveling up. I'm only getting like seven skill. I only got seven skill points for leveling up there. That's lame. There's a lot of dead things out here. Boom. So like, I don't know if zombies get harder. Like, the more nights you're in. I heard my friends say that like once they hit le once you hit day sixty they get harder. But like. I don't, I don't know if that's true. I don't know how this shit works. Bop. See, like I said, you can one-shot him with this. And also, I found out if you're in crouch, the pupil of the eye is your crosshair. And, like, if you aim at it, aim at, a, aim at someone's head with it, then that's how you know you're hitting them. It's a little something I found out. I, I see a dog over there. I don't know why he's not coming after me. But I'm okay with him not coming after me. Hey, are you dead or alive? Okay, you're still alive. Okay, no longer. Bam. Bam. Oh, shit. Oh, what an eventful horde. We had several cops. I hate the... I think the cops are my least favorite now. It was, like, the dogs... And then I'd probably say it's the screamers, just because they, like, bring more. But I'm okay with them bringing more. I just... The cops, like, literally destroy your shit so fast. Luckily, they didn't break any of the cement, though. Actually, there's, like, no damage done to the cement. Which is good, because... That shit takes a lot of cement. Oh, my. Get back. Oh, shit. Huh. Ow. Use. My skill in blunt weapons is now level 35. I haven't put any... 95. I haven't put any points in that in a while. I put a shit ton of points into it. That's why it's so high. Because back in the day, when I first started this, I put a shit ton of points into it. Okay, we're going to have to fix this up and add some more... Like, uh defenses I don't really I don't know what all the defenses are I know there's wood spikes and there's barbed wire I haven't checked what else there is see like, the thing with putting the de defenses and shit is they get broken so easily at least mine do so like it's like is there really a point 
Because they just get destroyed so freaking fast. And I don't even know how they hit up there. Eventually I'm going to change that to stone or cement, either one. I'm going to change that nice little overhang. I'm not going to make it like the stuff that's the floor inside of there because... Yeah, alright, well, it's 4 o'clock. The horde is over after I kill these punks. I can check that bookstore again because it should have respawned within the five days. Why am I so like low on stamina now? How much water do I have? I'm pretty hydrated, so it's not because I'm thirsty. Alright, well this is going to be a big loot because I killed a lot. Well, we have a shit ton of zombies out here, and I think there's a couple over there. Uh, I don't think there's any over here. Let me check this bird's nest. Okay, There's none over here. So, yeah. One just dropped the motorbike, or mini bike part. Anyway, I'm going to loot all this shit. I'm going to fast forward it. What is all this? What is this? I just got done a horde. Why are you here? Oh my. Oh my. Jesus Christ. It's a random horde coming by. Some shit that I don't need. My Jesus, there's more. All right, there, there. Now let's go inspect the loot that we have gained. Alright, let's look at some of the more notable loot that we gained from that. We got some painkillers, um, let's see, we got bandages, uh, we got a blue t-shirt, I don't even, like, some of the stuff I just picked it up. I was, I was taking everything until I realized that a lot of it was shit and I didn't need it. But I got two nail gun parts, that's good. I got moldy bread, forged steel, some shotgun shells, I got two rocket launchers, I got eight rockets, and I think there's some that are like, yeah, no, I got eight rockets, okay. I got a military vest, I got handlebars for the mini bike, and I got the chassis, or the chassis, however the fuck you say that for the mini bike. Got some boots, I got military fiber, I got another launcher, right, rocket launcher schematic. I also got another uh, leather armor schematic. I got military, I got a military helmet, military boots, 
black cowboy boots, some oil, and I took the ham sandwiches because I thought that like you could break them down into moldy bread, but no, you can't. So, I mean, they're basically pointless right now besides eating them, which is terrible, so don't do that. But I grab them anyway because that might be like helpful someday. And I got some paper, some of that, I'll scrap that. So I got forged steel, that's pretty dang. I got a shotgun too, I don't know if I said that. I got the shotgun and some shotgun shells. It's an alright horde. I leveled up a lot. I got 51 skill points in total, so I got 40 because I had 11 since I before that even started. What's the fix? It reduces repair time. How much? Uh, that's that's exciting. Okay, but yeah, that's uh, the day 35 horde. I'm gonna work on my base some more because I need to upgrade it all to cement. Start working on the farm, maybe do some more defenses. And yeah, thanks for watching.